Uh, so uh, yeah, as I say, a bit uh, bit knackered at the moment. Uh, babysitting duties, and uh, yeah, I could do with um, uh, a nice day off. I think <laughs> uh, from doing nothing. Uh, so I went to Canterbury yesterday on the bus with uh, with Litlin and uh, I, I thought we were going to go uh, when we the bus turned up. Um, I was hoping it was going to be a double decker and I could fold his pram up and take him upstairs. Uh, but uh, it was a uh, a little single decker bus, absolutely rammed with uh, with people. Uh, so I had to sit up the front with him in his pram, but I think he enjoyed it. But uh, I had a look round uh, Canterbury. I went, uh, I was still doing a load of um, work there. Uh, seemed to be taking their time. They really, mind you, I don't think anybody was working there. They were sitting on their butts when uh, when I was there. And uh, I went down and couldn't believe the amount of shops that have changed and most of it's selling uh, tat at high prices well that's the way I looked at it anyway anyway um, yeah that that uh, other program uh, Gary I, I, I remember I had to uh, mess around a little bit with the settings uh, for the uh, the audio out and uh, uh, so yeah a bit a uh, bit weird uh, VK4 GRB G1LQ uh, G1 in LQ VK4 Golf Romeo Bravo uh, Gary in Fairyland uh, Good uh, good evening all uh, Good evening there Dave Um <coughs> Yeah, well, uh, it's one of those ones where uh, um, I just uh, I downloaded it there the other day and, of course, I didn't get a chance to get around to it until um, uh, about half an hour before, uh, before I started. And uh, I come across uh, the weird piece of it. So... Um, uh, instead of just waiting, I uh, had to figure out why, so I darted up to Echo Echo and uh, done a few things up there and uh, couldn't uh, couldn't nut it out very quickly. So the easiest one is to turn that one off, turn the other one on. Um, at least I knew this one here worked the last week. Okay, uh, G1 NLQ. Uh, throw it back to you there, Dave, and the floor is all yours. Yeah, VK4 GRB G1 LQ. Yeah, yeah, I know the feeling. As I say, I uh, I've had a right nightmare with uh, Windows 11 this week. Uh, uh, you know, losing my audio. Uh, the audio went through the HDMI to the monitor, and uh, uh, then it, then it can't recognise the monitor, even though I can see the, the thing there. Uh, I'm seeing the actual program on it. Um, so somewhere along the line it uh, decided to take out the drivers and everything like that i think they're a bit um i don't i don't know i don't know what windows are doing um or microsoft are doing i think they're just uh having idiot uh, uh things there uh yeah and uh evening to uh, owen there as well i'll put it over to brian uh m zero dco uh, morning to you, morning to Lisa. I'll put it to you and then to Lisa from G1LQ. G1NLQ from M0DCO. Morning Dave, good evening Gary and uh, good evening to uh, any other guys there uh, in Aussie. Uh, good to uh, to hear you on there. Yeah, uh, Windows, it's... Um, I've, I've, when I first switched Peanut on, I, I'll do one thing now. I always go on to the Echo. Uh, test because um, it done it again today. It had actually defaulted my 
sound card for Peanut to the um, Blue Yeti, which has a 3.5 mil jack, so you can listen on headphones. And it had done that again when it's normally the default sound card. So, uh, yeah, I don't know what they're playing at. Um, I've had to do that before, go into the control panel or settings and go into device manager and it says uh, drivers uninstalled or, or no driver available or whatever. It's um, it's a real pain. Um, as far as Canterbury, yeah, they're, they're really messing up the top of that high street. And as you say, they they um, they, they seem to have got so far and uh, come to a ground uh, halt. Um, it's as you say, it's take, it is taking a long time, and yeah, you're quite right, Dave. There's a lot of shops selling a lot of tap for a lot of money, so uh, that's not brilliant. Anyway, we've got 22 degrees here at the moment. Uh, the washing's outside. Um, I'll let station manager talk about that. Uh, what about oh, I was um, for those that are uh, around this morning, I had a guitar lesson last week, and it uh, sort of clashed uh, with the uh, with peanut, so um. I was setting up my guitar and it was wouldn't have been worth me coming on, so uh, uh, I was uh, I was playing about with that. Right, back to you there, Dave G One NLQ from M Zero DCO. Yeah, M Zero DCO G One NLQ. Yeah. Uh, strangely enough, whilst um, uh, I was wheeling past um, uh, McDonald's uh, in Canterbury. A lad come towards me uh, with his white stick, and uh, uh, I think he was, I'm not sure whether he was talking on the phone or whether the phone was doing something for him, but, um, he, he, you know, he was, uh, he was navigating it very well uh, around there, but uh, it's not, not that good, it's not that good. What a whopping great truck. Concrete truck just come down here. Um, yeah, I it, say um, it, it's very difficult to um, to navigate uh, around there um, to uh, to do anything. Uh, yeah, Net did the washing uh, yesterday whilst uh, what you were whilst I was out um, babysitting and uh, trying to keep little and uh, happy. Uh, so, uh, uh, yeah, um, so I, I felt a bit, a bit shattered, uh, after I'd done that. God, there's, I mean, um, great big concrete mixer just come down here, and, uh, I think he's backing up down the end. Well, just what I want. I need to, uh, uh, I need to put a, a nice base down for a, a um, uh, a shed. At some time after I when, when I cleaned the garden, <laughs> um, yeah. yeah, yeah, I'll be saying no, no, I can't, I can't go yet. I've got to clean the garden, and you'll have to wait. <laughs> All right, it's probably over to Lisa. Morning, Lisa, and I trust you well. Um, Alan's back uh, on Thanet, so he's not. Um, He's not, uh, oh, he's packing up Simon's Road. Um, so I'm watching the camera at the same time. Uh, yeah, so, uh, uh, he's, he's back and he's not stroke P anymore. Uh, 2E1, the D. DU, G1 NLQ. G1 NLQ, 2E1 DU, in that Dave and Nick, and, uh, Morning to anyone else over here, and uh, good evening to Aussies. But uh, yeah, it's uh, certainly uh, quite bright out there. And uh, just to say, no, I haven't been shopping this morning. I didn't need to go. Went and got a, uh, a couple of bits uh, yesterday. But uh, yeah, because we uh, washed the towels uh, this week, we could do them last night. So uh, they're outside. So uh, yeah, certainly. Uh, a good day to uh, to get them out there. Uh, G1 NLQ 2E1 DU. Yeah, 2E1 uh, DU G1 NLQ. Yeah, okay. Uh, well, uh, I seem to have went through a few shirts this week with uh, Litlan. Um, 
he, uh, we were having to give him some antibiotics, which was uh, some strange yellow thing, and um, uh, he didn't want to take it, or he took it, or he got it all over his face, and then he'd wipe it on his shirt, and, oh, yeah, right, little so-and-so. Uh, his dad um, messaged me last night, oh, what did he eat? Uh, did he have any dinner? Well, mm, yeah, uh, I, I was, was going to go into... Um, uh, McDonald's and I thought well, I'll, I'll go get a burger for me and I know he he likes chips um, he's a bit of a veggie strange enough but that queue was ah oh, no I can't I can't do this so that's uh, why I went back and uh, got on the bus to go come back home again um, and then when I got here he, he, you know everything I said to him about no 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 he didn't want that so yeah it was a, a, a bit of a funny old day you see and uh, good morning to Jens as well. Oh, nice to see you up there, Jens. Uh, with that, let's pop it over to Owen. You fix that car yet, mate? Or are you, uh, are you uh, splash out on a new roller, I wonder? <laughs> uh, VK4 FODM G1 NLQ. G1 in our queue. Yeah, no, I uh, got the uh, thing back from the mechanic yesterday and they said uh, it'll cost 1300 to do the head. Uh, if I get a new head, it'll cost me 1800 uh, So I said to him, there, just fix up the old one and uh, go from there. there. And that's all I've heard back from him so far. So, yeah, everything's sort of on the quiet at the moment. Uh, until uh, the uh, the uh, we call the shop that actually does all that sort of stuff is, um, gets back to him. G1 and our Q VK4 FODM. Yeah, VK4 FODM G1 LQ. Okay, then, mate. Cool. They know how to charge, don't they? Um, I mean, the, the skimming of the head. Are you well. I would have said, uh, um, I know I can get it done over here for, say, a, a, around about the 200 mark. Uh, the new bolts, because they're normally stretch bolts, and then a, uh, a new head gasket. Uh, so, new head gasket. You're, you're only talking... Uh, uh, to, to, to bung that on and then just to uh, reattach everything um, probably about I don't know uh, you say, say half a day's work so uh, yeah they know know how to uh, they know how to charge don't they um, but I suppose they've got to make a living um, but uh, yeah uh, so, yeah, uh, well, at least you get it done, mate, and you know the vehicle, so, uh, uh, you know, do it that way. So, yeah, all good, all good. Well, my temperature gauge is saying uh, 25.7 at the moment. So, uh, yeah, it's a bit, uh, bit warm out there. And, uh, yeah, I'm just looking at the vehicle pulled up. Oh, I know who it is now. Yeah, <laughs> I digress. I'll do it about a dozen things at once, and I don't mo multitask too well. Anyway, let's put it over to Jens. Good morning, Jens. Hope things are okay. And uh, I'll say, uh, if it's uh, warm over with you there, uh, Delta Lima 4, Fox Charlie Tango, G1 LQ. Yeah, G1 NLQ, Delta Lima 4, Foxtrot Charlie Tango from Rosbach in Germany. A very good uh, morning to you, uh, Dave, and a very good evening to uh, the ones on the other side of the world. Uh, everything is fine here, uh, and I, I'm glad everything is fine, because yesterday, you may have heard this, we had a tremendous, uh, tremendous uh, thunderstorm here, uh, which came from uh, southwest and uh, went all the way uh, over Germany, uh, to the northeast, uh, so uh, to the area Berlin and uh, whatever. So now I think they are, uh, it's in Poland, but it was a pretty, pretty bad uh, storm here with uh, hail like uh, five to seven centimeters in diameter, which is great, uh, which is really big. 
really big things, and especially in uh, Bavaria, it was pretty bad. And also some kilometers north of here in Kassel, uh, the, the uh, streets were underwater, so it was all flooded there, and uh, and uh, uh, trees were broken and uh, fell down, and uh, all sorts of things. So it was very very bad yesterday. Uh, we here where I live in Rosbach, uh, we normally are a little bit lucky uh, because we are um, just in front of a little of a hill which goes up 400 uh, 400 meters or so. Uh, myself, I am living here on 200, uh, I think 280 meters uh, above sea level, and uh, so we are right at the at the start. And uh, you know, normally these uh, these uh, very bad weathers uh, they fly by here, which is good. And it was yesterday as well. We just had some rain, which was good in the end. Uh, but uh, you know, other parts in Germany were pretty pretty bad, uh, pretty bad off. So that was uh, that's the news. Apart from that, everything is okay here. Uh, things are going uh, strong. Uh, the temperature at the moment here in Germany is uh, let me have a look, 17 degrees, uh, increasing to 23, I think 23, 24 during the day. So this is what we uh, are expecting. So it's good to uh, <coughs> good to hear all of you. Uh, first of all, you in uh, Japan and Owen, and Brian, and uh, Jeff in Tennessee, and of course, uh, Dave. And uh, Mike, back to you, uh, G1, NLQ, DL4, FCT. I won't be staying very long because I've got another, uh, another sketch a little bit later, so I will still be listening a little bit, but uh, I'll be gone then uh, before the next over. But it was great talking to you, and thank you so much. Uh, all the best to you. And uh, Mike, over to you, uh, Dave, G1 and RQ, DL4 FCT. Yeah, DL4 FCT, G1 and RQ. Yeah, okay there, Jens. Yeah, good to hear. No, I, I didn't really see any news yesterday. I, um, I, I left here about half six uh, yesterday morning and... Uh, Proceeded round to my son's to look after my grandson, and uh, and I spent uh, all day with him. And um, uh, apart from, uh, I think I switched over to the uh, the news channel um, briefly to see about that um, little submarine that had been uh, diving down on the uh, uh, Titanic. Um, uh, I I really didn't. See any uh, any weather or anything uh, yesterday? Uh, so yeah, yeah, sounds like you had it bad there weather-wise. And uh, yeah, that was uh, it was sad about the uh, the, the submarine. Uh, it sounds like it uh, in imploded uh, from what I uh, I understand. Uh, so uh, yeah, that was a bit of a um, a, a sad occasion. Uh, I don't think you get me down there for uh, for anything. <laughs> not not uh, not one iota would I go down there. Um, you know, it's, I don't I don't know why they have to do it. Actually, um, you know, you can uh, you can basically uh, view most of that uh, on uh, online anyway if you wanted to. If you if you're that macabre about the Titanic, you know. Uh, but uh, there it goes. Uh, it, you know, it's claimed the death of uh, what about another five people or something like yeah, that. Five in that stuff. Yeah. So yeah, all, all very much a shame. Oh, uh, Jeff disappeared again. Uh, KB9. Uh, uh, he uh, he disappeared. But uh, yeah. Uh, let's pop back round to Gary. Uh, <coughs> excuse me. The K4 GLB G1 NLQ. Uh, G1 NLQ VK4 Golf Romeo Bravo uh, returning. Uh, no problems on uh, on that. Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, uh, some were saying there. Um, uh, some were saying there. You know, oh, it'd be a rotten way to die. 
Um, no, no. Uh, implosion. Uh, that's instantaneous. Uh, the running out of oxygen. Well, you will be sleeping and unconscious before you actually die, so you're not going to know it. So it's not painless. Uh, I mean, it's not painful. <laughs> Might sound it, but it ain't. You know, uh, uh, you know, oh, the oxygen's going to run out. Well, they're going to be they're going to be unconscious before they actually run out of oxygen. Um, but uh, yeah, out of all the ways to go, I think the one which went implode is probably the better of the ones. Uh, you know, of more humane. But then again, I think it was a uh, ridiculous, you know, that uh, uh, was an experimental uh, device. Uh, it's, n it, uh, it's never been tested. Uh, it, it has gone down a couple of times. It's amazing it didn't do it in the first run. Um, anyone who knows um, carb carbon fibre, uh, it is a strong, but it shatters. Something chronically. Um, yeah. But anyway, um, <clears throat> ridiculous, uh, you know, strange things. But, uh, um, you know, money talks. And, of course, uh, I hope they got their money's worth. Um, and, um, but anyway, uh, with that lot there, uh, let's see, what else has been happening? Uh, hang on a second, I'll take another load. Um, yeah, okay. Um, uh, Posty was, uh, Posty was, um, uh, kind to me there, uh, there yet, uh, Tuesday. Uh, he, uh, uh, dropped off, uh, uh a new two metre radio for me. Uh, that will be um, going on the Echo Link uh, system, and uh, uh, in my uh, in my uh, travels of getting the Echo Link stuff uh, running, I noticed that uh, uh, the club's call sign has been used, uh, or the repeater call sign has been used uh, once before. So I'm uh, now talking to. The dum dums in uh, Echo Link. Um, try and explain to them. Uh, I need a pa I need need to re redo the password so I can actually get in and I can utilise that call sign. Uh, can you send me the info? Go to this website. Go to the website. No bloody good. Try again. It's a type out another bit. Can you, uh, you know, explain what happened? Went to the website. Can't get. Won't the uh, other screen won't pop up. Um, you know, can you send me that screen so I can actually change the blooming password? Uh, I um, haven't looked in the emails uh, to see if they've done that or not. But. Um, <clears throat> Yeah, yeah. Um, the fun, the fun bits. Anyway, uh, G one NLQ, uh, VK four Golf Romeo Bravo Gary in Fairyland. Uh, back to you there, Dave. Yeah, VK four GLB G one LQ. Yeah, okay. Well. First of all, I wish you the best of luck with the uh, the mob at Echo Link. Uh, they seem to have very short fuses and uh, not much uh, uh, decorum about them uh, when you're talking to them. Uh, they very soon, uh, you know, you, 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 they, they say, well, no, you're banned. You know, as, as simple and quick as that. You know, they'll. Uh, uh, no, we're, we're not. We're not going to deal with you. You know, and it's. Um, I, I don't understand them. When when you've got guys like um, you know David uh, lot, you know, on Peanut, and they they're so obliging. Uh, they you know send you an email. They seem to understand what you're talking about. 
I mean, I understand from straight away from what you say there that uh, you know it's it's been utilised before, um, but you don't hold the court, you don't hold the um, the password for it, and uh, you know uh, let's face it, the guy who uh, who, who did it could be uh, it could be Silent Key or anything of this nature. And all you need is the information, but they they don't seem to be forthcoming uh, with it. I, I know Fred uh, had awful problems uh, trying to get on Echo Link, um, and and of course now you you want to do it via the computer, uh, sorry via the, um, uh, the repeater. And uh, yeah, I mean I'm I'm looking forward to that uh, that uh, we could come in and uh, uh, chat to you. Uh, um, sort of uh, over your, your local repeater. Uh, yeah, that's good. That's really, really good. So uh, looking forward to that. Oh, we had Wayne pop up then, and he uh, he disappeared. Uh, so uh, he came and he went. Uh, but yeah, I I do wish you uh, the best of luck <laughs> trying to uh, trying to talk to uh, to some of those guys uh, without being uh, rude. They. Uh, they need to uh, uh, sit, read, understand. I mean, it's not like you can get them on the phone or uh, get them on uh, on Echo Link and and just chat. I, I know these guys are volunteers and things like that, and uh, uh, Echo Link's been going a long while. Um, but uh, yeah, trying to get something. Um, uh, done is 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 a little difficult, a little difficult sometimes, and uh, yeah, sometimes it's not not your fault. Uh, M zero G C O G. G one L Q. G one N L Q from M zero D C O. Yeah, you would think being involved in the hobby uh, of communication that that would be first class, but uh, no, no, it's not always the case, is it? They're, they're constantly on transmit, never on receive. Um, yeah, unfortunately, that seems to be the way of some people. They're very good at barking out orders, but they don't listen to what the incoming, uh, so that uh, that can be a pain. Uh, what else? Oh, good to hear Jens. Nice to hear you there, uh, Jens. And, uh, yeah, let's hope that, um, that hasn't done too much uh, damage with the, uh, the storm there and the flooding. Uh, it's never brilliant, is it, at all? And, uh, yeah, what you're saying there, Gary, about the implosion of the, the sub, yeah, quick and, um, as you say, the most humane uh, way to do that and uh, get that uh, sorted out. Um, yeah, I, I, I don't see why they needed to go down there. I mean, that they have these remotes that go, if they want to see what's down there, there there's been remotes that have gone down there and um, had good de definition uh, footage of what's down there um, so uh, yeah it's, it seems a bit crazy but uh, stupid is as stupid does as old uh, Forrest Gump would say uh, so uh, yeah yeah no uh, no legislation for uh, idiots uh, right with that pass it back to you there Dave G1 NLQ from M0DCO uh, Quick uh, interruption, uh, DL4 FCT, now QRT. Thank you very much and have a nice day. And of course, Gary, I, uh, I didn't mention you last time. I hope I doubled nobody. Bye bye. Yeah, okay, Jens. Yeah, you have a good day, mate. And uh, yeah, keep dry. Uh, I hope it's drying out over there for you. And uh, yeah, you have a good and you have a good and mate. Yeah, so no worries at all. Yeah, I think the uh, I think it's going to be a small net today anyway. Uh, I think Fred. Um, I, I haven't spoken to Fred for the last couple of days. Um, I haven't had time. I literally haven't had time. Um, but, uh, I uh, I hope he's uh, he's doing fine as well and uh, sorting himself out there a little bit. But uh, yes, yeah, it's good to hear you, mate. Good to hear you. And uh, I will talk to you again soon. Uh, right, let's pop it over to uh, Lisa, 2E1D, G1, LQ. G1, NLQ, 2E1D, yeah, good to hear at the end on, and uh, other other li uh, listeners or people joining in, I should say. Uh, yeah, the coffee's uh, 
done. I shall be pouring that out in a minute. And uh, we've got the uh, back door open because of the uh, warmth. And I just heard some sort of uh, flying insects flying around. We've got one of these uh, things that uh, got a blue light on it. And when the uh, insects get near it, that, that's the end of them. You hear a popping sound and uh, and they get uh, uh, sizzled. So, uh, yeah, over the last few days, a few of them have come in and uh, not lasted very long. G1 NLQ, 2E1 D. Yeah, 2E1 DEU, G1 NLQ, yeah, okay, yeah. Yeah, we used to sell those in, uh, in Maplin's when I worked at Maplin. And uh, uh, it used to be just above my head at the till. And uh, I remember one day uh, something came in. Oh, and the crack was absolutely horrendous. This thing hitting the uh, uh, the, the the mesh that uh, takes them out. And uh, I don't know what it was, but it it actually smelt like. Frying in, frying in, insects. So uh, <laughs> yeah, not not good, not good. Yeah, as I say, I think it's going to be a bit um, uh, a bit low of um, uh, takers today on here. Um, so uh, we'll uh, we'll go around a couple of times and then uh, probably go and do other things. Let's uh, put it over to uh, Owen. Um, so I take it, Owen, you haven't been fishing. Um, uh, probably uh, sort of um, lack of vehicle, I suppose. Um, VK4, FODM, G1LQ. Yeah, Owen, you know, Yeah, no, no fishing. Uh, worse luck. Uh, can't go to the club meetings either because they can't. I got a lot on other people, but that's just the way it goes, I suppose. You can't really do much about it. But uh, hopefully, uh, it won't be long before I get dark going. Uh, my literally brother's going to help me pay for it, so that's good. I just got to pay him back. I suppose that's one good thing my brothers are for. But uh, yeah, no, I've been quiet here, just doing a lot of housework. Doing some work for an old fellow, so putting a winch in the back of his uh, four wheel drive. So it's all finished now, it's all done. Yeah, otherwise, we've been pretty quiet here there, Dave. Uh, we can't. Oh, oh, um, sorry, but not so that. G1 LQ. <laughs> we can't four FODM. Yeah, thank you, Owen. G1 LQ. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's a bugger without any transport, isn't it? I know when uh, Gary, um, you know, had his uh, car break down and uh, uh, it's sort of, um, you, you know, you're out the back of nowhere and uh, uh, trying to get stuff and, uh, you know, uh, you know, it's, it's a science. Well, as I say, yesterday I, um, I went on a bus for the first time in God knows how long. Um, I I think the last time I went on a bus. Oh, about. oh a good uh, three, three, four years ago. Um, yeah, so uh, yeah, I went on a bus and. Um, and it never been on a bus. And uh, yeah, I got a bus pass. <laughs> uh, free, uh, free bus pass. Oh, that was that was good fun actually. You know. <laughs> You know, just sat the old pass and uh, and away I go. And I, I don't know what the uh, the bus journey costs from uh, from the, uh, the Isle of Thanet to Canterbury now, but uh, um, yeah, it was uh, it was quite quite good. So uh, um, yeah, it made made a bit of a change not having to drive, uh, especially with uh, all the roadworks around. And uh, yeah, leave that to the driver. Ah oh dear, never mind, never mind. Well, as I say, it's all uh, all a bit uh, sad for um, takers on here today. So uh, I'll, I'll pop it back round to Gary, and then uh, we'll just nip through, and we'll uh, we'll disappear then. And I'll have me uh, I'll have me coffee. And uh, just looking at all these people keep walking by on the camera. Ah oh dear, never mind. And I'm I'm going to have another look at the computer. 
Um, probably pulled my hair out while I've got left anyway. Uh, to uh, to see if I can find out why my uh, my sounds have disappeared. Uh, so um, I'll have to look in, I suppose, work out what the uh, the uh, computer is, and see if I can just find the drivers again. Uh, I think that might be the problem. Uh, I know Gary wants to uh, to find the uh, the audio on his um, uh, 009 as well. Uh, so uh, Gary VK4GRBG1LQ. Okay, uh, VK, uh, G1 in LQ, VK4, Golf Romeo, Bravo, uh, returning. Uh, no worries on that one. We'll bring that down a little bit. I was bouncing um, pretty well over. Um, yeah, okay then. Um, um, no, it's... Uh, uh, yeah, I'll uh, during during next week I'll check the uh, I'll check um, um, that uh, that uh, audio problem out during during the weekend or so, and uh, get that one. Uh, it'll be only something minor. I just probably haven't ticked a box in one spot or something. Hi hi. Uh, but. Uh, not a not a worry on that. Uh, what else was there? Um, yeah, okay. Uh, Jens is gone. Uh, Owen uh, with his uh, his head. Um, yeah, yeah. Well, uh, uh, I, uh, I I I I don't worry about too much about uh, mechanics. Um, uh, they're uh, more of a pain in the backside to me than anything else. <laughs> it's probably because I've got to, you know, go into town and uh, get the job done as quick as they could do it and get it back out here where, uh, uh, back out here, uh, I could uh, buy the parts, put them aside and say, right, okay, uh, if I need something, uh, prompt, um, yeah, well, I just, uh, I just got to wait for it. Um, uh, other than that, uh, it's one of those, uh, one of those ones. Yeah, okay, um, uh, what else was there? Um, I noticed. Uh, I, I noticed that my uh, my audio going into uh, this one. I've got to put the uh, the volume up on this one. Uh, I noticed this uh, uh, peanut. I'm uh, I'm not. Uh, uh, what is it? Um, I'm probably getting to around about minus minus nine. Um, and I'd like to see the needle get closer to uh, about around about minus three to minus minus three to minus six. I would like to have uh, on this one. Okay, take another bite. Um, and uh, the other one, as I said, I've got to get the audio uh, worked out on it. As I said, it's probably just a blim and. Um, um, Mr. Tick or something in the box. Hi, hi. Okay, um, uh, the Echo Link, yes, well, uh, we all, yes, uh, as you understand, I don't have the password for it, uh, so I, I, I put a question out, uh, on, uh, on the club's, um, uh, members channel saying uh, any of the old timers recall who put it up uh, looking at the date of when that was done I would say the uh, bloke who was doing it went silent key uh, I say that is because uh, all my C4 uh, FM equipment which I first got 
was uh, from uh, the club member who was who uh, suddenly went silent key, and um, he was uh, he had the C four FM up on uh, up on the mount, and I've got a funny feeling he was doing the echo link at the same time or planning to, uh, but uh, so. Uh, yeah, all you got to do is just uh, send me a thing so I can change the password because uh, I can't uh, utilise that call sign until uh, uh, until uh, uh, I can actually activate it because all it tells me is, sorry, wrong password and no work. Uh, G1NLQ, VK4GRB, Gary in Fairyland. Back to you there, uh, Dave. Yeah, VK4 GRB G1 LQ. Yeah, it's, it's difficult, isn't it, mate? Yeah, all you all you want to do is, uh, you know, do a, a reset, and uh, you know, uh, but you, you can't do it all the time. Um, that um, uh, you, you can't get in there uh, to do it. It's it's uh, yeah, it's difficult, isn't it? It's uh, really difficult, and. Uh, uh, the, the, the trouble is, as, as I say, the, uh, the, the the guys at Echo Link uh, don't seem to uh, uh, are not the easiest guys to uh, uh, to uh, work with. But yeah, you never know. You might get an e an email and um, uh, you know do this, do that, and uh, you know, and away you can go again. I, yeah, I I don't know about any of you, but I I'm getting weed off that everything you do now is a password and uh, I had it the other week ah no you can't use that password you're using that password somewhere else and I you know um, I tell you not to write them down I have to write every blooming password down um, many. you know in in a book and uh, yeah you need a password this and a password for that and uh, you know it's um uh, you know, it'd be a password to go to the loo soon, or um, <laughs> uh, you know, you know, you'd be you'd be taking your your vows at the church, and uh, you're, well, you're gonna need a password for sex tonight, mate. You know, <laughs> and uh, yeah, yeah, that'd be a bugger if you got there and found, found it. Um, you, your password was uh, was wrong. Ah, you didn't put a capital in, or he didn't put a. Um, a pound sign or a <laughs> oh dear oh we got Ian come on from Bundy let's pop it over to Ian we'll, we'll jump a bit here and uh, oh he's gone again oh look oh. at that do you know what I, I spoke his name and he and he disappeared uh, he, he probably lost his password that's what he's oh he's back again he's back again yeah right um, VK four F I B K G one N L Q. Let's pop it over to you, mate, before we uh, we disappear. So we're a bit thin on the ground today. G one N L Q in the group. Uh, VK four F I B K. Uh, good morning there, Nettie and Dave, and to uh, Brian and Lisa and Owen. Um, Gary down there at Fairyland, uh, yeah, a bit thin on it, all right. Yeah, there's not a few, not many on it. Uh, yeah, I just got on. I've got myself a whiskey and um, uh, ginger beer from the factory here. Um, um, and uh, having a couple of snorts tonight, being Friday night. Um, I've got the tower up in the air, uh, fixed up the damage, uh, fixed up the 10 and 11 metre Yagi fixed up the quaji but the quaji is too high and you wouldn't believe it a mate of mine up in hands told me he said well try a different coax in i said oh no the 213 is pretty good and i said i haven't got much so i said the only thing i got is rg58 so while it was laying down i uh, took his advice and put the rg58 on and you wouldn't credit it the um 
the SWR drops down to about 1.2, and yet on the um, the 213, it's up to 1.8, 1.9. So I might have some troubles with that coax, I think. It might have had water or something in it. Anyway, I've got, um, I found some other coax. I've taken it off of other antennas here, and I had to join it. So I've got about 82 feet of it. I measured it up this afternoon. So I've checked it. There's no resistance in it. So I think I'll, on the weekend, I'll um, uh, lower the tower back down and uh, put the coax through the window again. There's 213 and see if it's any better. If it is, well, then I'll have to replace it. And also, I've cleaned up all the rust with a hammer and cold chisel and an electric drill with a hammer and cleaned up all the rust and painted it and put some enamel and undercoat and everything on. So hopefully that'll keep it at bay. So I'm up and running on HF again now, Dave. Um, I haven't taken any pictures of the factory yet. I'll do them next week for you. I've got the daughter coming over on the weekend, so... Um, I don't know what she wants to get up to here, but um, hopefully she might clean my house for me. <laughs> oh, that'll be a laugh. Anyway, uh, back to you, mate. Uh, G1 NLQ, this is VK4F. Bye, BK. Yeah, VK4F, I BK, Cuban Hill Strange. Mind you, I've had it myself. Um, yeah, everybody slates the old um, RG58, but. You know, it is a good old um, cable, isn't it? I mean, we we all used it for uh, for CB in the in the day, but it it, it does work, and um, yeah, yeah it, it, you you could find that there there could have been anything anything, you know, even a, a, a critter had um, had a, a bit of a uh, a chew at it and. Um, uh, sort of done something with uh, with it, and yeah, you, you never know. You never know what it uh, what it can be. So uh, yeah, and good morning to Arthur. I see Arthur's popped up there. Um, yeah, we we've got to uh, get the old uh, vacuum cleaner out and uh, have a good old go at uh, uh, doing this again and uh, bits and pieces. Uh, yeah, so. Uh, uh, but it, uh, it you, you you do the vacuum when it's uh, when it's hot. <laughs> you can't do it at night, can you? Because uh, uh, you wake everybody up or uh, upset everybody. Anyway, I'll pop it over to Arthur. Uh, good to hear you in anyway. I'm glad you got, you got your tower um, tower back up and, and sorted out. Uh, G zero AHA G one LQ. Morning, Arthur. Yeah, good morning, everybody. Yeah, all after the, good evening as well. <laughs> yeah, no, well, a bit late on parade, but I thought I'd um, I've I've only just the switch minute switched on. I've I've been on the other computer watching the hose the hose line, you know, for for was it uh, brain masters and like and uh, it, oh god, that's lively and stupid. All all those stations on there, and I'll pick up two. Once in Whitfield and once in Dover, <laughs> talking to each other on the World Wide Net. <laughs> yeah, really, really quite silly. Oh, yeah. Now, I went to the club last night and had, had a chat with a few laughs and all that. They've got they've got a thing this weekend up at Manston and um, uh, museums on the air or something, but I don't think I'm going to get there. There's a there's a big chance that my daughter might be over back from over from Germany because her uh, her partner's uncle's going to pass away, and so they're going to come, shoot back um, to well, obviously go to the funeral and all that. See, seeing as some people still seem to be having funerals. <laughs> anyway, I I'll just listen for the rest of it, Dave, and um. Uh, and I'll, I'll, I'll catch you probably somewhere else later on today. All the best to the guys in Oz, because I, I've only seen... Um, on my call list, because I switched on last... Got, so I took a bit more... B, K, I, B, K, yeah. Got, he, he was the only gentleman that I've heard this morning. 
and I presume you've got a few more. So anyway, Dave, back to you. I will only listen from now on, OK? Don't call me in again. All the best, mate. Have a good day. And all the rest of the guys out there, Golf Zero AHA. Going clear. Yeah, G Zero H A G One L Q. Yeah, well, we weren't going to be uh, hanging around too much longer anyway, uh, Arthur. Um, we're a bit thin on the ground uh, today, um, so uh, yeah, it's uh, it's one of those things. Uh, I wasn't expecting uh, Fred on, or uh, um, well, <laughs> we, you know, a few come up and. Uh, uh, I mean, we had Brian last week, um, but I know he wasn't uh, feeling uh, 100%. So, yeah, yeah, all good, mate. Yeah, and it funny? 91, uh, uh, you know, Tour Group 91, and, uh, yeah, Whitfield to Dover, you know, via uh, the Worldwide um, um, Tour Group. Yeah. <laughs> amazing, isn't it? Absolutely amazing. Never mind, that's the way it goes. Uh, but uh, all done in the best possible taste. Right, let's pop it over to uh, Brian, uh, M0DCO. G1LQ. G1LQ, M0DCO. Good evening to Ian. Good to hear you uh, on, the, uh, on the peanut there, Ian. And also good uh, morning to Arthur. Yeah, it's, it's a funny old world, isn't it? Uh, that where well, you're talking about um, e e hearing people just down the road. Uh, one particular year, we went to uh, Crete. Um, we was over there, and in the hotel, the um, uh, the tour rep was actually from um, from Sturry. You go all that way and meet someone that, uh, that used to live sort of uh, about uh, three, four miles down the road. It's crazy. So uh, yeah, and passwords. Yeah, don't get me started on that. I I tend to put them on um, uh, an audio recorder, uh, so I've got them to hand. And uh, yeah, then as you say, it comes up. Oh, you've used that password. Uh, um, uh, you can't use that one. No, it's it's not got this. It's not got that. Uh, it's just crazy when they can come up with a system that uh, gets round it. Um, it would be far better. Uh, of course, there'd be problems with that as well, no doubt. As these uh, as these things are. Anyway, I'll say um, seven threes. Um, thanks for running that, Dave. It's uh, always appreciated. And uh, with that, I'll be listening uh, right to the uh, the end. G1 NLQ from M0 DCA. Oh. Yeah, M0 DCO, G1 LQ, yeah, well, I, I I get totally fed up with uh, passwords. Uh, you know, oh, no, you got to have a capital where you've got to have this or you've got to have that. Oh, no, you've got too many numbers. Oh, you, you've not got enough numbers. And, uh, oh, you know, oh, this is a safe, yeah, you're a safe password now. And, uh, oh, dear. And, and the other thing is the computer. I don't want to blooming password to start it yeah when I start up I don't want that uh, but you know oh it's um it, it's annoying it really is it uh yeah it does my head in it must do your head in even more not being able to uh, uh to see you know it's um yeah bright pain never mind but yeah thanks for coming on mate good to uh, good to hear we'll we'll catch up uh, somewhere along the line as well uh, 2E1DUG1 NLQ. Put the donut down. <laughs> G1 NLQ, 2E1DU. Yeah, no donuts today. Just finished uh, my uh, coffee. Yeah, good morning to uh, oh, you believe that, you believe anything. <laughs> <laughs> I know he's uh, not coming back, but if he happened to be listening, uh, good morning to him. But uh, yeah, I do the same as uh, Brian, Dave. I've put one to an audio uh, uh, recorder and uh, yeah, uh, some of them, uh, because I read braille, sometimes I uh, I braille them out as well, but uh, in case something happens to the uh, recorder, but yeah, you, you can remember certain ones, but uh, not all of them, because I use, uh, use them for uh, shopping online, so sometimes you have to put them in and, after you know if you haven't used one for a while anyway uh g1 nlq 2e1du thanks
Yeah, 2E1DEU, G1LQ, so I was just watching the postie go by up to uh, the flats. Um, yeah, yeah, it's, uh, yeah, it's a, it's a pain, isn't it? But isn't it a pain that you've got to be that secure for absolutely everything in this world now? Absolutely uh, amazing how it goes. But, uh, yeah, never mind. That's the way it goes. All right, let's uh, pop it over to Owen, uh, VK4FO, a DM with G1 and LQ. So, that day, I was, um, was sitting around here with my computer hooked to me, um, the uh, laptop, and this stupid mouse doesn't like my lounge chair. I can't use the mouse too well. So I'm trying to find out where the mouse is sitting on the screen. <laughs> Can be a problem sometimes. Especially when they come back at you, you're not quite ready. <laughs> uh, but that's no, no, all good now. No, that's it too. It's, it's a bit of a pain. I mean, I had the same problem when I used to play games. Because you get in there, you put your password, you put your email address, and uh, later on, uh, they want you, uh, you put your email address in, they say the email address has been used. And they won't accept anything. And uh, you've got to make up a whole new system again. I don't know how many times over the years I've had to make up new uh, passwords and uh, change it to uh, Google or some other email just so you can actually use it. But, uh, yeah, they're, definitely they're not making it user-friendly. But then I say you've got to think there's a lot more people getting on the net now, so they've got to change things around to allow for multiple people now. But, uh, and good evening, Ian, and uh, Gary, and everyone else on the side. All right, I'll go back on the side here. This might be my final, but you never know. I could be here still, I might not. Uh, G1NLQ, uh, VK4, FODM. Yeah, G1NLQ uh, returning. Yeah, okay, yeah, no worries at all. So I don't know what this postman's doing. I think he was trying to do the reparse and next door, and, uh, uh, they've, uh, I think he's, uh, yeah, just, just, just staying on a minute, I'll be back in a sec. Yeah, apologies on that. It's all right. Another postman. We seem to be getting a different postman every day now. Well, <laughs> no, every other day or every uh, <laughs> week is uh, a bit different, and uh, he did, wasn't sure where he was going. So, yeah, apologies on that. Right, pop it over to uh, Ian, and then we'll uh, we'll pair this and uh, uh, see what's uh, happening the rest of the week. VK four, if I BK G one in it. A G1 NLQ in the group, VK4 FIBK. Well, you shouldn't have started me on passwords. I've got this damn TV here, and it's a brand new one. They only delivered it this afternoon. Now, I've been trying to get iView, which is an ABC uh, app for the TV, because I like to watch some of the um, country programs like um, uh, Landline and... Um, Oh, what's the other one? Um, backtracks or something, um, where it shows you all the old towns and that in, in Australia here. And then Landline tells you uh, what's going on with the sugar industry and uh, the fruit and everything here and where we're selling it and everything. Anyway, um, I got it. Uh, Pauline, when before Pauline moved out, she got iView on the TV, on the other TV, perfect. And I signed in. Um, and yet I've got the I've got it written down here, and yet I signed into this new TV, 
and it won't. It, I can download the app, but it won't let me sign in. I don't know what the hell going on unless it's registered to the other TV. I don't know. And talk about passwords. Oh my God! Every app you got now, you got to. You, you can't get a normal app where you download it and use it. You got to sign in. You got to create an account and everything. Uh, it, it's the same with my gov and uh, many bank private and main roads. Um, uh, the council here in Bundy. Um, who else is there? Ergon Energy. Everywhere you go, you got to create a damn account, oh, and, and you got to. You can't remember everything, so you got to write everything down. So you don't want to lose a piece of paper. That's for sure. All right, Dave. Thanks for doing it. I'll stick around till the end. Uh, yeah, not many on tonight. No. Um, well, we haven't heard from Ralph for a fair while on here. Um, Brian's not on. Um, who else is missing? Oh, yeah, there's a couple more missing here, Fred. Oh, yeah, old Fred and his bloody fish and chips. <laughs> anyway, or a pizza. All right, Dave and Nettie, you have a great day over there. Don't go getting up that poor postman. Um, not like we do over here. Um, I'll say seven threes to you and the group, and we'll catch you next Friday night. Hopefully there's a few more on. Uh, G1 NLQ, this is VK4 FIBK. Yeah, VK4 FIBK, G1 NLQ. Well, there's actually the same thing with uh, the, tele the television apps over here, and uh, yes, it's normally down to uh, the um email address so because they always want an email address don't they an email address then the password and um yeah i've done i've done it before where uh I, you know i've used the gmail uh um uh email address or something like that uh but it is uh it, it's very annoying very annoying and I don't know why they need it. They they, they, don't, they don't need it. It's purely simply so they can sell all your uh, your details on. Oh, we'll sell you uh, your your email address, and uh, yeah, you so you can get a lot of spam stuff come through the uh, the the, uh, the door. Well, I, I I have a problem at the moment. My uh, my email address. I'm I'm AOL, and uh, my main one is fine, uh, but then uh, my DJ uh, Arthur one. Um, it, um, it it basically uh, I get loads of spam emails on it. It's coming. Uh, it comes through from Yahoo in America, and if they sent me an, if somebody sent me an email now, it would be time stamped to whatever Florida time is or, or New York time. Uh, so it's 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 really weird. But ah, oh, the, the the stuff I get. Uh, that you know, I just, I just, blooming Bitcoin stuff, and uh, do, do I need a penis extension? And uh, <laughs> oh, you know, just pile it. I just, you know, boom, boom, out, 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 out. You know, and then, you know, and, and another couple of hours, you got another load. You know, and uh, uh, oh, FedEx sending me things, and they're spam emails about the parcel or. Amazon about the parcel I want, you know, and uh, ah, yeah, it's a it's a right pain. Um, but it's it's a, an email address I use all the time. Um, but uh, yeah, it's a, yeah, a bit of a, uh, a so and so. The other one is um, they're sending out uh, spam e um, text messages now. You know, like oh yeah, I dropped my phone. I've had to get a new SIM. Uh, so mum, if you get this, can you? Um, can you um, uh, message me back? You know, um, uh, you know, uh, via, I think via WhatsApp. You know, um, you know, and it's uh, yeah, yeah, another spam one. All right, guys, good to hear you, and uh, you all have a good week. Um, yeah, well, I think Fred is um, probably not on because of the move and uh, because of him. And I ran out there at the same time. So, yeah, so Fred's uh, not, not brilliant. Um, and a few of the others. And, of course, it's uh, the coldest part of your year, and it? The oldest part of our year. So uh, thanks, guys, for coming on. Good to hear you. Um, 
Send me sues to you, Gary, uh, to you, Brian, Lisa, and to you, Ian. Um, we ain't got any more listeners, so uh, catch you all later from G1 NLQ. Teddy, bye. Now. Uh, hey, I like the uh, extension you might be getting. Um, Nettie had a bit of a laugh. Over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She should be so lucky. <laughs>